So I'll get straight into this one. I often get messages um, and calls from people that are saying, I'm having trouble with my, my car, terminal's corroding, it won't charge, it won't run. This is the first thing I'd check. Too often I see terminals that look like this, and way worse. That's, that's pretty mild. They're always going to build up some corrosion if they're exposed. There's a couple there, another one there. So it's going to be just a quick video show you how to maintain your terminals to get longer between cleaning them and better life out of your batteries because if the cables are poor here and the power can't travel poses resistance they get hot and that's what starts the cycle of needing new batteries not charging draining one battery weak batteries that sort of thing so i'll show you what you need this is basically all you need um, a spanner obviously whatever size terminals they are uh, trojans in this one are 14 mil a cordless drill with a wire wheel uh, an empty squirter bottle a battery terminal protectant for afterwards and i'll tell you what's in this it's bicarbonate soda or baking soda now, four or five teaspoons some warm water fill it at the top i generally put it in the, the spray bottle and spray it on but I will pull the terminal off and just show you what it does as well. So I'll get, get some of that into there and we'll get started. Now one thing with, if you're going to start spraying uh, the terminals to get rid of that, don't do it on your concrete. You'll end up with patches all over your concrete, like so. Like so. Get out there in the grass. that aren't too bad like say that guy just get your squirter and soak them. we need to clean our terminals regularly check this one out that one is almost worn out there that one's just starting to wear off for the sake of this video I'll keep going but that one I'll probably replace off camera what I'll actually do is I'll remove one of these cables and dunk it in the solution just shows you what happened but if you're going to start removing cables switch it onto tow under there you know that switch the tow and run now we've got the cable off there he's there still got a bit underneath where you couldn't see Once your couple of affected cables are off, you'll still see there's a little bit of shit around that there, and that's where your wire brush comes in. Wire brush or wire wheel. did end up replacing that um, that terminal that was the bad one but have a look at this and this is why you got to look after your terminals check that nut out it is basically 
rotted away around the edge. That was obviously that way. So if it lost contact in that edge there on that poor terminal, eventually it's not contacting at all. And that's why people start replacing batteries when it's not. It's a simple terminal. Once that connection is lost, your voltage can't get through clearly. So it's not going to charge because the charger won't uh, sense it's there. Get on these little things before they become big issues. Once all the nuts are done back up, pick something like a terminal protectant. I use this. It is pretty expensive. You put a couple of coats of this on, it dries hard. Anything super cheap, go anywhere. Just any terminal protector is better than nothing. Get on your terminal like that and literally just coat him like that over all of them go back and do it again make sure it's really running down the side and everywhere it might not look great but it'll save it could save your batteries and it'll definitely save your time cleaning them next time so that's it for this video that's terminal care uh, batteries aren't cheap terminals and terminal cleaner is do us a favor if that was helpful to you or you've got any other dramas Put it in the comments, I'll do a ton of other videos, there's a few more golf cart ones already up. Um, do like, do subscribe and hit the bell for notifications when new videos go up. Thanks for watching.